Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and to the Blackwell Legacy. Sorry all the episodes are kind of in a weird order this week. I, I've just been, you know, as usual, it's just been a crazy busy week and it's just kind of what's easiest to record. Because I think Oxenfree, I feel like it's going to take a long time and I feel like this could be a long time, it could not be, it's 50-50. Um, but anyway, let's hop right back into it. I've got a new mouse today, so hopefully there won't be such weird little springy clang soundings. I finally got a Razer mouse and I'm super happy with it so far. It's really sensitive. I've turned down the sensitivity a ton, but I'm still getting used to it a little bit. So let's continue on. We exercised our first ghost last time and I have a feeling something bad is gonna happen in our room here. Oh. Joey, come here a sec. Maybe not. What do you want, sweetheart? <laughs> Maybe not. Any idea who the deacon might be? No idea. Although, he must be a pretty formidable fellow, considering what's been going on. Oh, well... Okay. I don't suppose you know anything about Susan? Nope, no more than you. Anticlimactic. I think I've heard enough. Yeah, let's get- Alright, um, I'm not... missing something, am I? I'm not ready for bed. Are you sure? I returned the dog to Nishanti, so it's night time. Are you sure you're not ready for bed? Should I... Should I go out? No. I open those curtains and a dozen windows can look directly in here. Those curtains stay shut and prying eyes stay out. All right. Well, interesting. Hang on, I'm gonna turn the volume down just a hair. It's a bit loud. Okay, there we go. Uh, that's, uh, that's not what I expected to happen. Should I... Do I need to mix things to... no? Most likely he is. <laughs> That's uh, some good dialogue on the side. It's haunted by someone named... Maybe there's a connection, but I can't see it. Okay, well... I don't see what one has to do with the other. Uh, already off, off to a, a slow start, huh? That leads to my bedroom. It's an oversight. Oops, I didn't mean to click on the bedroom. I wanted to actually go to the computer. Do research on Deacon and That's too common a word. Whoever the Deacon is, I don't think I'll find him this way. No, I meant like smoosh the two together. Hmm. And Alexander Davenport was listed as being on the hockey team at NYU. It doesn't say anything else about him though. All right. My article hasn't been published yet. Typical. Well, I'm a bit... With him staring over my shoulder, I can't. Okay. I'm not... I have nobody to call. All right, don't call anyone. Let's leave and... You coming? Yeah, sure. I, I don't know where to go. Okay, well, the psychiatric... Oh, should I go talk to... Please be advised that visiting hours are now over. Oh well, looks like we have to wait until tomorrow. No can do, toots. Remember what she said? The deacon comes to her at night Ew. when she's sleeping. Waiting until tomorrow won't do us any good. What? You think we can just waltz right into Susan's room? Sure. You're just talking How? now? Improvise, sweetheart. You That's wouldn't talk before. All, <laughs> all right. Yo, what up? I'm bad at improvisation. Let's do it. Is Dr. Quentin in? He's long gone, miss. You can catch him tomorrow. I need to speak to Susan Lee. Can I see Is her? the doctor in? I want Visiting to speak to Susan. hours are over, miss. She's probably sleeping by now. I highly doubt that. About Susan Lee. I told you. Visiting hours are over. Oh, Come what are, back tomorrow. What is your shift, dude? You've been here all day. Reason with the guard begs seduce the guard. Threaten the guard, distract the guard. Hey, what's that behind you? Just the duty roster. I'm on double shifts this week. Oh. oh, never mind. About Susan Lee. I told this. All right, yeah, everything back. coming out. It will only take a few minutes. Sorry, miss. Rules are rules. Nobody gets in past visiting hours. Nobody. 
<laughs> About Susan. I visit. Come back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Beg. Please, can't I go past? Oh, jeez. I told you, oh. visiting hours are over, miss. I thought you were gonna give in. About I visit, come back. I'm not gonna seduce you. I, I don't want to threaten you. I'd rather seduce you than threaten you. I feel like threatening is... Neither of these are good options. Uh, you're kind of cute. <laughs> I'm flattered, miss, but I'm gay. <sighs> oh, I'm sorry. Oh, man. That was the best possible outcome. I love this game. <laughs> About Susan that was hilarious. I told she you, is visiting, come as back. awkward as I am ever. Oh, Look, you'd better let me pass, or... Or what? Ah, <sighs> dang. Keep glaring at me? That was funny. Forget it, miss. Thanks. Don't threaten me again, or I'll have you escorted out. Okay, I'm just gonna sit here. About Susan Lee. I t visiting come back. Oh, never. I don't think I need any of these other keys. What? That was not the dialogue that was- Oh, hey, Joe. Interesting. <laughs> Whoa! Hold on there. You're messing with you the radio. Go in. I gotta clear you first. Joe. Shh. You want to start or keep your yap? Well, then let's. Uh, Joey, come here. I need you to distract him clearly. Do the lights not flicker unless Joey's here? <gasps> Fuse box. You need a key to open it. Joey! I want to talk to you, Joey. Come here, I need a key. What is it, dear? What happened with that radio? What do you mean? When you got near the radio, the signal got interrupted. Was that you? Yeah. How do you do it? <laughs> yeah. No idea. Although your aunt never let me get near the TV during days of our lives. I'm sure there's some scientific explanation, but I have no way of knowing, and frankly, who the heck could we ask? <laughs> That's fair. <clears throat> what was it like, staying here? Like? I was on a different floor, but it's all the same. Twenty-five friggin' years. Hovering over your aunt's shoulder, staring at the ceiling. You want to know how many cracks there were in that ceiling? Not really. Fifty-four. <laughs> or maybe fifty-five. I was never sure about that last one. <laughs> how well did you know Dr. Quentin? That quack. He'd come into your aunt's room, poke her, prod her, try to get her to speak. He didn't know from nothing. I'd just as soon never see him again. What was Auntie's condition like? She was a rotting vegetable, sweetheart. Aww. They kept her so drugged up that she could hardly move. Which is probably for the best, come to think of it. Without the drugs, she uh, wasn't pretty. What happened the to doc her? told you all about that. You don't need to hear it again from me. That's all for now. Were you right, following me at right. that time? Joey? Yes, darling? That's all for now. Right, right. <laughs> Looks like a fuse box. Judging by the flickering lights, it must be broken. Okay, so I need a key. Looks like an internal phone. For paging doctors or patients, I guess. I don't have anyone to what? call. But, 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 you, Susan. Some small keys. One of them is labeled FB. I assume that means fuse box. Hey, Joey. I don't think I need any of these other keys. Joey, I need you to... Joey, I need you to... Radio. I don't think so. What? Just a small transistor radio. Okay, Joey, I need you to... I need you to... Do that! Fuse box key? I could probably do something with this. I don't think I- Did you- did you grab it? It's not in my inventory. Oh shit, not options. Uh, there. It's, it's not in my inventory. Did you- did you take it? I'm confused. There should be something that it makes it more clear. I guess let's walk over here and see. You need a key to open it. Wait, but I- but I- but- 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 Psst, Joey. <laughs> what? I thought you grabbed it. What do you want, sweetheart? That's all for now. Right. Okay. So that... I thought that would have worked for sure. 
What does this sign? It says that this floor is undergoing renovations. That explains a lot. I'm not stealing stuff from the hospital. Okay. But you said you didn't need any other keys. Some small keys. One of them is labeled a fuse box key. I could probably... I don't think I need any of yeah. some small... One of them is labeled fuse box key. I could probably do something with this. Okay. I don't think I need any of these other keys. Oh, sorry. That's the rice cooker beeping, if you can hear that. But, ah, now you have it. I just had to keep clicking on it, apparently. All right, that was weird. I feel like this game is slightly buggy sometimes. I'm not sure if it's the way that the game is, or... Or, um, if this is just a weird version. Or if I just have bad luck. Wow, that made it dark, huh? Now you've done it. You better find a place to hide quick. <laughs> Locked. Whatever's back there, I can't get to it. Oh, I didn't realize I would leave, especially with the fuse box. Wait, what? The door is closed now. Eh? What happened? Alright, let's try this again. It's a bit weird. Looks like a fuse box. Okay. I hope you know what you better find a place. Yeah, yeah, hide, 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 hide. Over here. Yep, there you go. There we go. All right. Around the corner, around the corner, quick. There we go. All right. Okay. Finally. She's asleep. 15 minutes yeah, in. like a baby. It won't be long. Before what? Nope. Before that. Excuse me. Hi. Oh. Please. Please. Can't you help me? Please. I don't like you. I don't know what to do. I don't want to burn. Okay. Please. The others are gone. You're the only one. Please. Uh huh. You can't hear me here, but you can hear me in your dreams. Please, wake, wake up, up and, and help, help me. me. Let him rant. See what he wants. It's out there, watching. Oh, waiting. that's horrifying. What's Susan? Susan. You can help me. Okay, now let's... Should we set all this be forceful? Hey! Ignore them, Susan. Listen to me. Does that mean Susan help can hear me. Joey in her sleep? Please! I'm talking to you, clown shoes. He doesn't have shoes. You're, you're talking to me? Yeah, so can you calm down long enough to tell me what's going on? I... I can't. You're like me. What do you mean? Dead, like, like me. me! Wait a minute. Just a goddamn minute. You know you're dead? Yes. yes. Well, that certainly saves time. We can help you. Here, grab a hold of this. No. no. Get that Get away, away from me. From me. Hmm. What the hell is wrong with you? You need saving. We're here to save you. What's the problem? I can't. I like him. What are you so scared of? You're stuck, right? We can help you move on. No. I don't, I don't want to. You don't want to move on. You don't want to? No, I... I'm afraid. Oh, you're afraid, are you? You believe this guy? What do you want? Safety. Sanctuary. It's following me, waiting, watching. Terrifying. Trying to take me. Don't like this but at all. But it hasn't caught me yet. Not yet. Yeah, whatever. This guy's off his nut. Let me handle this baby doll. I know how to speak to spooks like this. Don't like when you call me baby doll. I guess I'll let Joey take over. No. I want to know what's after him. What hasn't caught you? It. 
it. Why are you ghosts I've so everywhere. <laughs> unhelpful? In every shadow. In every corner. Why is it after me? Why? The soft touch ain't gonna cut it, sweetheart. It's Don't too green. Me Let me show you how it's done. Sure. Do it your way, I guess. All right, Mac. Spill. You've scared these girls literally to death, and I want to know why. What are you so afraid of? I... I don't want to burn. Burn? Oh, oh, I get it. You think you're going to hell. It's the devil himself. Oh. He told me. Please don't make me go. Oh, you're that's why he doesn't want to move on. Huh? Yes! Yeah, well, I don't see any devil. There's just you and me. And you know what? I'm worse than any devil you'll ever see. Hey! I've been doing this for 40 years, bucko. Every ghost I meet goes to their final rest one way or the other. You're scared? I don't give a rat's ass. <laughs> wow. Two people are dead because of you. So take the damn tie and let's get this over with. No! You can't make me. Don't make me burn, please! <sighs> Hurts, don't it? How? Oh. Ghosts aren't supposed to feel pain, but I've learned some tricks. Wow. Now take the damn tie. Joey, stop it. Give her a chance? Handle ear. Oh, now I'm Joey. This is confusing. It switches back and forth between who I'm acting. You want to handle this? Go right ahead. Let's see you do any better. Try the guilt card? Try the guilt card, I guess. I don't know. You killed two people. Almost killed a third. Doesn't that mean anything to you? They called me. Why would they call me if they couldn't help me? Yeah, that didn't work. I'm taking over. So, are we going to do this the easy way or the hard way? Please. No. What are you going to do to me? Please don't make it get me. I don't want to go to hell. <laughs> hell, Schmel. You want to stop talking crap? Hey, stop. Let me talk to him, okay? You want to handle this? Go right ahead. Let's see you do any better. Oh, hmm. You can't keep going on like this. It's better than burning. Is it? Uh-huh, yeah, you had your shot. Now it's my turn. I don't believe in hell, buddy. But you have two choices. The slight possibility of an eternal torture in hell, or the dead certainty of an eternal torture by me. But... You can't! Sure I can. You gonna stop me? Make your choice. I... Wrong answer. <laughs> You're hurting him, Joey. Yeah, that's the idea. You got any better ones? Let me talk to him. You want to handle this? All right. So Go, let's, let's see. Let's see you do any better. I know a safe place. You can hide there. Really? Where is it? Not far, but you'll have to trust us. Trust you? Why should I trust you? Nah, no reason in particular. Because nobody else will help. Because nobody else has offered to help you before, right? Yeah. You ask and ask for help, but nobody answers, right? No. Nobody answers. Well, we have. We're gonna help you. Has anybody else said the same? No. No, they haven't. I think... Oh, I'm so tired of running. If you say you can help me... I believe you. Definitely thought he what was gonna be to like be a devil though. Just listen to my friend. Here, just take the tie. I wonder if it'll be really bad when we get into my mind though. You know what to do. I can't believe she pulled that off. Ow. The music is hopeful. I feel safe. Oh. Are you ready? Yes. I really think so. It's really nice out here. Almost like. Like. 
Uh-oh. At last, I have found you. Hi. No. Oh my you god. Lied to me. That was what? It's here. You lied. What's that? Oh crap. Joey. What? Joey, get me out of here. Stay away. Stay away. There is nowhere to go. You cannot return to the mortal world. You can only go through me. Uh -huh. Accept the punishments for your sins and come with me. Help me, please. You brought me here. You have to save me. You have to. I mean... Fool. No one can save you now. What were your sins, dude? I'll give dude? you a moment to prepare for the eternity to come. But then, you are mine. It's polite of you. Helpless response, confused response, straight denial. What is that thing? It's come to take me to hell! Just like it always said it would. Uh, oh, oh, I, sorry, I did not realize I could... What is that thing? Uh, excuse me. Converse with me not. <laughs> I shall give him hey, time there's to more dialogue prepare there. himself for the eternity to come. But then, he is mine. Uh, ask about his origins, reason after mercy and conversation. Ask about his reasons. Why are you after this man? Yeah, why? For his sins. What sins? All this time, he has not renounced them. Even after these many years of death, he still carries them with him. How did you get here? What is here? It is but an abstract concept to one such as I. I move at the power of thought. At the speed of death. A weird answer. Once my business is concluded, I shall trouble you no more. Can't you just let him go? He has killed many with his madness. His sins weigh him down even as we speak. Ask yourself, does he deserve mercy? I don't know what he's done. Yes? You may think so. But your heart does not believe it. You have witnessed the results of his actions with your own eyes. Okay. Yeah, I want to know about the flask, but I want to know about his sins, too. What are your sins? What have you done? I don't know. Please, God, I don't know. I didn't mean to kill those people. It's just I've been so scared, and I don't know why. Please help. What is that in your pocket? My flask. Yeah, what's in it? Nothing. It's just a force of habit, I guess. So you are an alcoholic? I used to keep whiskey in it when I was alive. What is that thing? I don't know. It haunted my dreams when I was alive, and wouldn't leave me alone after death. And now, there's no place left to run. So what can I do? What does he want? He wants me. I don't know why. What is that in your pocket? My flask. Yeah, what's in it? Nothing. It's just a... Hmm. Used to keep so it's the same thing. I wonder... Uh, excuse me. Converse with me. I shall keep up with Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can't you just let him go? He has killed many with his madness. His sins ask your... No, you might be right. What? She speaks wisdom, worm. What was the only other option? You are totally without redemption. And you know it. Collect yourself. For the time draws near. Dialogue and the words are a bit different. Oh, please help! What is that? My flat. Yeah. Nothing. It's the same it's conversation. Just what is this? What 
What is that? Life. Yeah. Nothing. It's just. Uh, what am I supposed to do with this rock? Why did I pick up a rock? Uh, can I spot? Can't you? He has his sin as. Yes. Yes. You may think so. You have. What do I do? I wanted to pick up a rock. Why did I pick up a rock? I'm so confused. Uh, can I spot? Can't you? He has his ass. Yes. You may. You have. What do I do with the rock? I'm super confused. Please help. I don't know what to do, dude. Uh, can I spot? There's nothing else to click on, is there? What is that? Nothing. Yeah, it's just the same. Just... What do I do with the stone? I must have missed something, like... Uh... Can I spot? I don't- I don't know what to do. I right-clicked. I was trying to right-click. Okay, maybe I can't right-click. What is- <sighs> Dead one. Oh, s the time has come. That scared me. No. No! I'm sure, I could have saved him. I just don't you know how. You said you'd help! You said you'd help! I'm sorry. No! Oh. Heed the deacon's lesson well, for he brought it upon himself. Go now, and forget not what you've seen here. Remember, actions in life are remembered in death. We shall meet again. Alright. Yep. I have nothing to say about that. Jesus Christ, kid. You alright? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. What took you so long? Well... It got a little complicated. Well, I'm just glad you're okay. Let's get out of here. I need some air. I know the perfect place. Oh. He was scared, Joey. Scared and confused, and I couldn't do anything. Yeah, well, who says you had to? I was just so useless in there. He still moved on. We did our bit. I guess. I really wished I could have popped him one more time. He really hacked me off. Is that your answer to everything? Don't you start judging me. You managed to pull it off. I'm impressed. I'm just glad you're okay. Joey? Yeah? Why did Auntie stop? Stop what? Stop doing this. This ghost saving or whatever it is we do. Oh. Ah. Uh. It was you. Me? She wanted to take care of you. Wanted to do it right, she said. Stop Aww. listening to me. Stop saving the ghosts. Just put all her effort into taking care of you. And then she fell into that weird coma. Yeah. I see. I guess there's a lesson in that. That was an ab 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 there? abrupt stop to the music. Yeah. What is it? <laughs> Was that the end? I'm just gonna end like that. Yeah, it looks like it. Well, this is not the end of Blackwell. There are... Let me see if I can hover over Gog without making this go away. Hopefully that's still recording. I also have Blackwell Epiphany, Deception, Convergence, and Unbound. So there's four other games in the Blackwell series. I'm not sure which one is next. I'll have to uh, Google it and check, but I will be playing more of that, or more of this uh, next time. I'll hopefully have the last, maybe last episode of Oxen Free out for my Friday one as well. Um, yeah, I really like this so far. I'm really curious. I'm sure there was a way to save that dude. If anyone has any ideas how to go save him, I might do a very short episode of that um, like, or maybe just like in the beginning or tagged on to the end of the next one, just because I'm curious how you could save him or what, like, how different it would be. Um, 
Oh wow, they're based you're based on someone or is that your voice actress? Oh maybe it's both. You kind of look like each other. Oh no, these are your voice actress. Oh, okay, voice actors and actresses. Cool. But you also kind of look like each other. Awesome. The music got very loud. Oh, this is cool. Oh, I like Nishanti. And her dog! Dr. Quint. I'm sure we haven't seen the last of him. Well, you don't look anything like a voice actor, but okay. The deacon, I... There has to have been a way to save him. Who are you? Oh, you were that. That's right. The kid who was outside. Dave Gilbert, the demon. I wonder if we'll see him. Bob. He looks like the, the guard. Special thanks? Oh, okay, I'm just gonna keep going. Alright, uh, um... I'll be back in a second if there's anything else after the credits. Otherwise... Oh! Coffee! <laughs> Special thanks to coffee! <laughs> Lots of it. I like that a lot. I definitely look for coffee. Special activation code. Ooh, wait! Bright eyes. Oh, well, is that just the end there? Okay, cool. Perfect, just in time. I have to eat dinner right after this. There's hundreds of confused spirits out there, sweetheart. And there's Don't nobody else who can help them. Don't like it. There's just us. Bestowing eternity on every sob story out there. One lost soul at a time. Do you think we'll have Joey move to, on in the end? Or not. If that'll be like the last game? Wait, bright eyes. I want to enter my special activation code. I'm so curious what that does. What do it- Oh, it just closed. Alright, well, maybe we'll see what it does next time, if anyone also has any ideas of what to do to save the deacon. Uh, otherwise, I'll check it out on my own. If it's anything super interesting, I'll record it, tack it on at the beginning of an, beginning or end of the next episode. Um, thank you all for joining me in the Blackwell Legacy. If you have any questions, comments, or ideas down below, please let me know. Otherwise, I'll see you all in the next one. Until then, bye!